Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rat here from Rat Tarot and this is going to be Leo Sun, Leo Moon and Leo Rising weekly tarot reading August 13 to August 19, 2018. So this is going to be a four card tarot spread and after I'm done with the tarot cards I will also make a Lenormand reading for the week uh, for Leo. So uh, the first card here will represent the uh, topic for Leos for the week then the second card shows the core of the situation. Third card represents the challenges Leo to take on. And afterwards we do have the guidance that uh, Leo should adopt for best results from the week. So let's see what you got Leo here. Now the first card, that will be the Five of Swords. All right. So you have to kind of like uh, dress yourself with a very warm clothes, figuratively said. Because uh, this card shows up a hostility you are going to uh, experience. Either into your career or either into your relationship. That card usually as a topic is associated that people will try to put the blame on you for something that it is yet to happen. Uh, five of Swords are uh, points that you could have done just so much, all right? And it's not that you couldn't uh, execute the things perfectly, but also the card points that sometimes things are not kind of counting entirely on you or they don't depend entirely on you. So uh, when we do have the Five of Swords, it is very important that one person realizes their limitations and their capabilities, especially when it comes to place uh, to kind of like pointing the guilt, because uh, it's very important because one may realize that despite of how much, you know, they have tried uh, and they couldn't push things through or they have done it, but it turns out to be a bitter victory. Uh, it was not their fault, you know, because they could have done just so much. So, especially if this is about personal relationships, uh, now very important here is to be very strong mentally because uh, that card is associated, the, the other person is going to try to attack you with a, a past events that you have a contribution into and those events didn't really uh, contribute it for the uh, longevity of the relationship either romantic or a friendship one so be warned that that week you are going to be attacked verbally most likely from people which will try to uh, make you so you take you take the fall for them then the second card points the uh, wow okay that will be the core of the situation here that, that is another five the Five of Pentacles, and it points that um, the situation become extremely insecure, there were problems overlooked, and now those problems are kind of looming from every single direction, either into your career or either into your relationship, and they become so, much, so many of them. Not necessarily uh, unresolvable problems, but it is just the quantity of those problems are, is quite many, and uh, on every turn, or when you resolve one, it is another challenge you popping up from it so basically uh, things will uh, things either relationship wise or career wise become insecure and of course when things become insecure either with their with a project or either with relationship you know everybody is trying to wash their hands with somebody else so you should be very careful that this someone else isn't you. Now, one more thing I want to add to the five of sword it is that just this is the cumulative uh, behavior and energy and if you are a kind person Leo you know and very responsible one you do you do there is a high chance that you will be the one that will be placed the blame on you know so kind of like uh, you have to be more um, thick-skinned with this is an expression in my country where you don't give a crap way too much what the people say you know and also you should be again very aware of what your limitations were when that thing is happening and when that thing was worked over here so yeah you have to be prepared here to face some insecurity which other people will try to to blame you for or people or they will try to blame also people that you care for <clears throat> Then the next card represents the uh, challenges and the difficulties, like 
it is not enough here. The world car is, is what we do have, so it will be close to impossible for you to just detach from that um, <clears throat> from that situation until the situation is resolved. So kind of like the uh, new perspectives that you may that you, uh, that you may want to look forward to for now are going to be set in how you know there are those kind of a situations in one life where people just want to get over with you know and just go along with their lives not looking back behind their shoulders remembering that poignant experience they had. Well, this is going to be such kind of a situation with the cha with uh, the uh, um, contradictory here that you cannot just place it behind your back all right so that's why guys you have to be uh, strong enough to endure it until it it, it, it is over because as I said it, this thing cannot be um, it cannot be reached a closure with only on your behalf I mean there are other people involved and they also need to reach a closure they got to do their job so uh, yeah basically uh, that's that for the uh, physical interpretation of the week and you have to be very very strong here I'm not necessarily aggressive that will be another thing I'm gonna say but let me turn over the uh, next card here we do have the Knight of Pentacles which represents the guidance and aggressive as I said it's very peculiar that we do have that card because the card expresses that you have to be rather more compassionate than aggressive all right rather more elaborative than uh, ignorant here and uh, when we talk about the Knights of Pentacles this is the state that you need to adopt it is how to you know how to conserve what is yet remaining in there so there is still hope into into that situation but this hope does not involve restarting the project or reassess uh, um, resuscitating it all right the the hope uh, it is let me give you an example let's say this is about a project in your job which is failing and there will be a heavy consequences for the people working on now this car points a hope that you may not suffer those consequences or in other words you will not get fired because the the project it is uh, it is over or that could be a major disruption into your relationship but it doesn't mean that it's gonna have to be the end of your relationship all right it is just you know uh, <clears throat> the consequences that are gonna be suffered here will be most likely suffered from your partner let's say or they will be worked over but this card does not says that if you are compassionate and if you are determined to make things right you will necessarily transfer uh, traverse excuse me um, this activity here this enterprise into something um, successful as a matter of fact the word success it is uh, dead for a long time for that activity either regarding relationship or career and as a matter of fact as we do have double fives here it is another thing that uh, makes impression into me it, the, the, the double five says that it is time for a change it's going to be a difficult one but it is necessary one so you can place those kind of um, predicaments popping up here behind your back for good so let's see what we do have Lenormand's uh, what the Lenormand card has to say for you we have the clouds then is the key and then is the coffin all right so the cloud stays for confusion for uh, lack of clarity all right deception excuse me or lack of a way one does not see a way moving on forward in result we have the key which is either opening or in this case closing a, a contract a, a door in general closing the way so the lack of direction is gonna close the door toward that particular project or agenda which is gonna come to, in, to its end which is the coffin the coffin represents an ending in Lenormand <clears throat> and completion if uh, the cards before that are positive but these cards aren't exactly positive so yeah, you have to prepare yourself very well for, um, you know, for a particular, I cannot say loss, let's say, but a, a pathway which will be closed for you, Leo. And maybe this will be 
for the better. So that being said, this was your weekly tarot reading for August 13 to August 19, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.